called Caitlin. Uh, and I'm wearing one of the rattiest shirts I have, so deal with it. But you guys know when it's videos like this, you know it's more of an announcement thing rather than an actual video. Uh, so I I'm going to be as real as possible with y'all. Uh, I'm trying to really save money. I got two cons I'm going to this year. Uh, one in early March, if the weather permits. Uh, another one in September. And then uh, I went ahead and bought the uh, Sideshow Collectibles Hot Girl statue, which is over $600. Uh, and that's going to be this summer. The majority of the payments is going to be taken out uh, this summer. So basically, I'm going to be not buying as much. I'm still going to be buying Funko Pops when they come out. I'm still going to uh, ECCC Hunt and all that crap. Um, you know, I just bought Medusa like yesterday. I'm filming this on Thursday. Yeah, this is Saturday's video. But I'm filming it on Thursday. But I did buy Medusa, so I'm still buying. I'm just not going to be buying as rapidly uh, as I did. Uh, yeah, sometime. Yeah, the, the Pokemon ones are available right now. I'm waiting till it's more of a. I can find them for a good price. You know, usually I would just go ahead and buy and let the points add up to like $5 rewards and stuff. Um. But I'm just trying to be a little bit more careful uh, with money right right now because I do want to go to these things. <laughs> I do want to go to these things and I do want that statue. So, basically, I'm out of videos. <laughs> the Cinderella carriage that I posted today or Thursday when y'all are watching this, uh, that was my last pre-made video. Um, so, here's what I'm thinking. Sunday videos are now going to be optional okay uh the only reason i started doing four videos a week is because i had four videos a week to do i was buying uh so much and spreading it out to a point i wasn't buying like a ton but i was spreading it out to a point um where it could easily be fit into like four videos uh doing the random hauls and all that stuff um so yeah <laughs> that won't be happening anymore if i'm cutting down buying and cutting down as rapidly right so they're gonna be optional now you're definitely i'm gonna try to do three videos a week for sure it's just going to be made with older stuff and i'll get to that in a second uh but if i have a spare video and i feel like i really want to post it because that's my problem i film a video and i want to post it like immediately i want to post it uh so i have to restrain myself so if i do end up getting uh some stuff in and just getting it up to a point where it would make sense to do four videos a week then I'll post on Sunday if not I'm definitely posting still Tuesday Thursday and Saturdays okay occasionally maybe a video will be replaced with a live stream that would be fun for me <laughs> I imagine fun for y'all uh, but basically what I want to do with this video is ask y'all for ideas so right now I was going around the room looking for different colors because I was thinking about redoing the Roy G. Biv challenge. It was the first video I ever did on my channel and it sucks. So I was going around trying to look for it and then I thought it's kind of an old idea at the same time. I don't know. Uh, and I just keep getting all these ideas in my head. So right now I'm thinking another Roy G. Biv challenge. Uh, a video that shows all of my chase pops. In my collection and maybe even their value because I know some people still especially like newer collectors they see the word chase or they see that sticker on a box and immediately they're like cartoons with dollar signs in their eyes sometimes it's not the case some chases can be worth a lot not all of them uh, but it's okay to get excited for them still uh, so yeah I'm really thinking about doing a video with all my chase pops maybe a video with all my glow in the dark I did a flocked video a long time ago with all my flock pops at that time uh, maybe a glow in the dark video a video showing all my completed sets in pops like you know you'd think as big of a fan as I am about it I would have all like the Batman anime series pops all the bombshell pops I don't but I do have a few completed sets in my collection so it wouldn't be a super long video <laughs> but it would still be pretty good good I think uh, just all the complete sets uh, and then other than that go back to doing the statue reviews of statues that I've gotten in the past so I've shown 
at least briefly all the statues in my collection but I haven't reviewed them in depth all of them so I'd probably start with like the diamond select statues I have a lot of uh, DC ones based off the animated shows uh, I could do the bombshells but the bombshells I would have to do upstairs and there's not yeah, I'm just using the ceiling right, right now, but I wouldn't have my filming light because I don't want to risk taking that up and down the stairs because that bulb is 50 bucks. So I do not want, and I don't want to risk taking the statues downstairs again without their boxes because uh, they're expensive too. So I would ha have to film it upstairs with a little bit worse lighting, unless I did it in my art room. I just thought of that. I would have to definitely wash down the table every time I did it, make sure there's no paint anywhere. Yeah, I could do that. <laughs> That's no big deal. So yeah, bombshell, if you guys want to see bombshell statues be reviewed on the channel, uh, more like all the older ones that I had prior to starting my channel, as well as the diamond select ones. And then after that, I'm open for suggestions. If you guys want to see any top five videos, whether it's be my statue collection, my pop collection, yeah, I got some action figures, as you guys can see. Probably not too many people want to see the action figures, because I have a lot of them. Like, most of those are out of box, the Power Ranger ones. Um, but most of them are still in box. Um, but yeah, if you guys have any ideas for top five videos, or, you know, uh, a challenge video that I haven't done yet on my channel, uh, anything like that, I'm open to suggestions. And also, and please let me know if you guys want to do the, the Roy G. Bid thing, because... That would be the easiest thing to do, because I, I can pretty much just look over and see every color, <laughs> so that'd be real easy to do. So, uh, yeah, I really want to keep the channel going, I just don't want to break the bank while doing it. Um, so please give me your suggestions, because I'm open. <laughs> and also, uh, comic videos, if you guys are interested in seeing Let's Talk Comics again. Those take a little bit more work, not as much, obviously, I just have to go back and either reread the uh, comics or, you know, look them up online to make sure I'm saying the right shit. <laughs> uh, also, there is going to be some more custom videos up probably March, at least one in March for sure. Uh, so you'll have that to look forward to, but yeah, I just need suggestions, guys. <laughs> but anyway, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Please, please comment down below your suggestions or even DM me on Instagram if you want to, and, uh, Thanks for watching, guys. Remember, it's a community, not a competition. I'll see y'all later. Bye.